Me mining here. This is going to be a quick dig for silver. At an abandoned silver mine, what we'll do is take the Equinox 800 in prospector mode and just detect this little area. It's been detected before quite heavily, but it's full, or should be full, of little tiny bits of plate silver. At least that's what's been found here before. There's got to be at least one left for us. See this? This is where they drilled the test. You can see they went down at about a 45 degree angle to uh, see if they could find a vein. Which is why this area is flat and cleaned out. They would have brought a cat or an excavator in. Leveled it so they get their machines in and that exposed some fresh rock. This is all waste from earlier mining. Pitter patter, let's get at it. So the secret to detecting the really small stuff is low and slow. Otherwise you'll miss the signal. That's a solid two, just under that yellow rock. Or something that's repeatable and gives a constant number. Might be good. There's a little piece of cobalt. Don't think that's it. No. silver, the white bean calcite. It's fairly heavy for its size. Nice little muggy. calcite, the green stain that'll be nicoline, but right up in there is a silver vein. So a real mixed metal. 
There's a bit of silver right there too. Whoops. It's dirty. It's heavy. So there's a metal content in there. I think it's mostly nickel. But a bit of silver. That might be a nice rock to stick in acid and etch. Alright. Let's keep going. bounces around that'll be junk did get chased away by the weather, got soaked, and called it a day. Here are the larger rocks on my tailgate, and the smaller ones I'll clean up at home. Most of these smaller specimens are silver plate, and I've got to show you something unexpected and really cool under magnification. This microscope was sent to me to try out, and I thought, what better to look at than some small pieces of silver? See on the far right, there's silver wire. It's also known as silver curls. I am really surprised to find it in these samples. Didn't know it was there until I put it under the microscope. Most natural silver tends to have a plethora of other minerals mixed in. Silver wire is known to be almost pure silver, usually about 97%. This one appears to be silver, and then something that gives an iridescent purple hue. Probably chalcopyrite, boronite, or bismuth. My vote is for boronite. Tell me what you think. At first, I didn't think I could see any curls of silver, but in one end, it does look like some is trapped in the white calcite. Science still doesn't know how these wires form. This one's looking like high grade silver, but no wire. This one didn't look like much with the naked eye, but under magnification, it's glorious and there's wire. The magnification is somewhat similar to what I'm getting from a jeweler's loop, but it does allow me to share what I'm seeing on a video. And to wrap 
wrap it up, a few more silver plates. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.